Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me looking at week three of the Premium League uh, Weekly Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about t today's farm or this week's farm or whatever. 305 number of islands, too. Okay, so you have an M by N grid, zeros and ones. You may perform an add land operation uh, at any. Uh, that which turned the water at position into a land. You're given position. Da, 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 da. We turn away after. Okay, so what are we doing? So basically, we have these queries, and you're trying to get island at every step. Um, yeah. So connected components is generally, um, of course, used. I mean, it's just kinetic components. But of course, the static version usually you would have, um, you know, depth first search or breath first search. Um, and both of those are fine. Of course, for this particular one, we we is this is a dynamic version where um, we're making you know connection possibly after every query. So um, and then the, so of course the way to do it is the uh, the one way that I didn't talk about, which is um, I want to come with this to roll and see. Yeah, um, which is uh, 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 which is the way that I didn't talk about. Uh, what the, union fine. Uh, disjoint uh, set union is that TSU? Hmm. Oh, disjoint set data structure. No, disjoint set union data structure. I don't know. But in any case, uh, or commonly known as union fine. So that's basically the idea. Um, yeah, what is RNC anyway? RNC is actually oh. Well, RNC can ind independently be big, but it can, uh, in total, just be 10 to the 4th. So that should be okay. Um, you can do this in a number of ways uh, in, in terms of uh, whatever, but what is this other stuff? Well, I mean, eh, depending on how you want to say it, union find is log of 1, so, or log of some constant, or like reverse, uh, uh, inverse, inverse argument function, but... Um, K is equal to the position length. Oh, did I miss? No, I mean the position the length was ten to four. But so each one does log of these. I think technically union find is faster than this, unless I'm misunderstanding something. Um. But yeah, I mean I'm still. I don't know the not naive or not union fine version that has a higher complexity. Maybe we'll check out later what they're looking for. But anyway, my, my idea is still going to be union fine. So of course, your parents, um, and then this is just off my head, so uh, definitely forgive. But I'm just going to just do yeah. Let's just say um, C for coordinates, and then if parents of uh, mm, if C is in parents and parents of C is not C, then parents of C is equal to union fine of parents of C, and then return parents of C. And this is union fine stuff. I'm not going to go over union fine today just because, as I always say, I maybe I need to do it one day. But um, but it's usually like a week or, or on, um, it's usually a full lecture or two in an algo class. So I'm not going to be able to. I just don't have the energy to kind of do it. Uh, um, or like, you know, like, I, I don't know. It's just too much for me to do it in a short self video. So definitely study on that. But the idea is just that, um, I, I mean, okay, I, I guess I didn't really talk about the idea yet. But yeah, using the union find, the idea is that for every um, position that we make, where we query, as I say, um, you look to see if it, if it connected to up, down, left, right. That's basically the idea. We want to make sure that it isn't already a land. Because, for example, if you just keep on giving a zero, zero, then maybe that's a little bit, you know, it doesn't change the answer, and then you have to have to handle the edge case. That's all. I mean, this doesn't change the problem um, on a deeper level, but you just have to handle it, right? So, yeah. Find of A, U B is union line of B. Uh, yeah, uh, do, 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 do. parents of U A is equal to U B. I think that's fine. Um, this is, so we do path compression, but not b compression by way or 
fine by rank because I am just lazy or com com uh, union by rank. I mean, um, mostly just due to laziness and usually you don't get that much impact from it. But yeah, so OK, so then now now we can do for X, Y in positions, um, we can basically, yeah, if so okay so we have to set up the directions first and of course in this case we want the directions to be um yeah the four core no di directions and you you can you'll see how i use this later and if you haven't seen me do this before but yeah but for nx or for dx dy in directions what do we do um we have nx ny is equal to let me actually check this real quick um hmm. yeah i mean let let's do um let's do a scene set or island you go so this could be an island set i i don't i think you could do it another way maybe with a, a matrix but let's start with a set keep it simple for now right so if x y in scene then that means that we've this is already an island so adding this does nothing so we just continue uh except continue is not quite right we have to return the answer right um so so what does that mean right so previous is equal to uh or so islands is going to be equal to zero in the beginning so then if we see this we append islands because the number of islands haven't changed otherwise well otherwise how do we so putting this down in theory wow that is a little bit tricky isn't it hmm. i mean I, there is just more edge cases but we, i think we can handle it um let's see so if Mm, okay. Because basically the thing is that um, for every insertion, you can remove at most four islands, right? And what I mean by that is that if you have a, a shape that looks something like this, like do do do. Uh, do 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 ASCII art and X are the islands. If you add, add the if you if you fill in the one in the middle, now you went from four islands to one island, right? So that's minus three. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. We will have to kind of figure out how what that means, but that's basically generally the idea. Okay. So then now, if we we have to keep make sure that it is in um in bound. So if not this, we continue. Oops. To the other direction, right? Um, and then maybe we have um, separate islands kind of thing as a set, say, right? And then basically now, yeah, and also if it, um, not, nx and y in scene then continue meaning that we don't have to merge with it if it's not um i don't write it like this uh we don't have to merge with it if it's not an island right otherwise we do want to merge with it and then we just do it you find you find of in this case it is nx and y right so yeah so now um the representative of this you find we can add to the set and you have to be a little bit careful not to kind of merge them as you're going because if you merge them as you're going um there's a chance that there's like a, a i wouldn't call it a race condition but a condition where you're you're like it's just harder to prove your invariant is true every step of the way um if you're not careful about it right uh, i mean not to say that you can't be careful just that it's harder that's all uh, and i like to you know remove it if i can but yeah, so basically, islands would add one for the new one, and then for every unique number that we see, we subtract one, right? Meaning that we minus 
the length of the separate islands because that's the that's the number that now we're merging together. I think that's right. Maybe it's not. Uh, maybe I'm off by one. Um, and then, of course, at the end, we union or defend. So for for a key in in what I call it separate islands islands uh, we union the current key which is x y and then we union the key and that should be it conceptually but very easy to make silly mistakes uh, this is even more silly but at least I'm not gonna lose sleep over that one uh, hmm oh I forgot to uh, yeah and uh, and so that a pen islands right Okay, that's still no bueno, but hmm. So how? So this? Oh, oh, oh! No. So separate island should return one. So this should be zero, right? Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Just want to make sure. I mean, it's very possible that I have typos all over the place. So yeah, yeah well. Okay, so yeah, separate items didn't add anything, so this that's not great. Oh, 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 I am dumb here. Um, if you not in parents, then parents sub C is equal to C. I think I didn't set the base case. Okay. Uh, it's still wrong, but at least, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if there's an at least, but... Hmm. Let's take a look. Uh, okay, still wrong. It's not seen, and it is do, 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 do. so zero one. Hmm. It's right for the second one, but that this is a stupid case. Or <laughs> like it doesn't really uh, challenge what I'm doing. So of course it is right. Hmm. What did, doing something weird, but. It's because we didn't add the i. Um, uh, I'm just being sloppy. We, we need to add the x y from here. That's why. Okay. So now it sees it, and then now it subtracts it correctly. A lot of silly mistakes lately. Hmm. And shape. But uh, eh, is this okay? Maybe. Let, let's let's do the case that we talked about, which is um, I mean, it doesn't really matter what the numbers are, but uh, which is the 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 diamond thing. Right, so we have zero one, and then maybe one, two, 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 and okay, and then I'm missing the one zero, maybe, yeah, right, and then now I'm doing one one, right, so it should actually go down significantly. Let's see, okay, that looks good. I mean, that was the only thing one, two, three, four, one. So let's give it a quick submit. Hopefully, it runs fast enough, and it is good. Cool, um, yeah, I mean, this is. You know, uh, um, without going that deeply into it, because, you know, you, there are specific videos for Union Fine, um, you know, you can effectively treat this as all of one. I'm going to anyway, and this is because this is two of one operation. This is also all of one advertised. Um, so, yeah, uh, you know, uh, which means that this is all of um, Q for the number of queries, because each of these is just a lot of all of one operations, right? Um, so, yeah. Keeping in mind that this is only four things, which means that this has at most four things, even though there are four loops. So yeah, so this is all of Q. So I don't know what this log RMN is. So maybe, maybe I do want to take a look. Is there a hint or something? Hmm. I'm just curious what the. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't know what the other one is. Apparently, maybe we could do it with that for search or something. Maybe that's it. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I actually lied. Wait, did I? Hmm. Well, I don't initialize this. That's why I don't have this time. But the space can be uh all times c. But no, it, it's at most. Um. So I guess they did it that way. But no, uh, I didn't go over the space complexity though. Uh, no, I kind of did. Uh, or I went over the time complexity because it's all of Q, um, where Q is the number of positions. 
Um, and but that's also the space as well because for each query we we allocate one space right and of course that is also bound by r times c or m times n or whatever but q is a more precise bound so you don't even need r times c um, yeah I don't um, but that's because I did it in this way the magic is in this space case um, and also maybe this depending on what say because I guess here then this part is always always true, so you could do this instead. But um, yeah, I don't know what else to add to this one. Let me know what you think. Stay good, stay healthy, to good mental health. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye bye.